Dear friends, greetings to all. Today's topic is graphical method. This is in the fourth chapter, diagrammatic and graphic representation, followed with introduction, collection of data, classification and tabulation, and fourth one is diagrammatic and graphical representation of the subject. business statistics before studying the topic one appeal to every one of you if you have not subscribed my channel mwn.space.com just press subscribe in the video and it will be subscribed okay thank you now let us move on to the meaning of graphical representation graphical representation is the i mean presentation or graphic preparation of graph on the basis of the classified or tabulated data it is in the form of lines usually drawn in graph paper the some scale basis and this uh, graphs are classified into two major types one is graph then uh, graph based on the frequency distribution that is graph for frequency distribution second one is graph for the time series then let us see first graph for the frequency distribution in this graph x axis is represented with variables that is income expenses marks profit y axis is represented with frequency number of families number of students like that and this graphs are based on the par sorry bar diagram just like bar diagram from that the lines are drawn and the the types of graphs are this type of graphs are histogram frequency polygon frequency curve ogives or cumulative frequency curve the next one is the graph for time series this graphs are based on two scales one is natural scale method another one is ratio scale method now in the natural scale method data are i mean the represented in graph in the following types one is line chart for one variable that is one character income only for example one subject marks only then line chart for two or more variables that means income expenses savings or cost of production sales profit like that so three or four lines may be there here only the mean bar would not be prepared then only lines only it would be then in the first one one line here two or more lines the next one is band graph band graph is the some kind of design that is from cost of production that may be divided into prime cost administration cost or uh, cost of production cost of sales sales profit like that then it would be shown in different colors okay band chart then um, in graph based on the ratio scale this is otherwise called as logarithmic scale in this type of scale the variable should be converted into logarithms and after the conversion into logarithm the lines can be drawn maybe one or two lines may be there that's a very simple one okay graph as per as graph is concerned very easy i have told graph for frequency distribution graph for time series time series means x axis will represent with i mean time month quarterly year like that 
10 years means 19, I mean, uh, 2010, 11, 12, like that. And left side will be represented with the, uh, variables, okay. One side variable, no, no frequencies here, right. And the uh, easy one only, that one is the frequency, x axis is for variable, y axis for frequency. Here, the time series means x axis for time, we exist for free variables. And like that you can be studied very easily. Here the second category being the natural scale and the ratio scale. Natural means as it is, it would be taken. Ratio scale shows the proportion of the value, variable. Proportion of the variable can be known through ratio scale. Okay. Thank you very much.